Hey guys, it's me Grace and today I'm going to be filming for you guys BuzzFeed Fall Treats Tested. Now I was going to film three but one of them kind of failed and I ended up not having the stuff I needed for it. So there's only going to be two treats in it. There was going to be three. I was trying to do more but I'm a really bad cook. I not that great in the kitchen. So I just tried as hard as I could to do as many as I could, which is only two, sadly. But anyways, I hope you enjoy. Give it a thumbs up if you do. And let's get on to the video. Okay, so what you're going to be needing for this treat is just a half a cup of Nutella, two eggs, and a little teaspoon of sugar. So you're going to crack your eggs into this bowl. There's one, and there's two. I'm not going to now protect. Oh my gosh, it worked. I'm so surprised. Okay, bye bye. Okay, I get this one. Okay, I got as much yolk out of that as I can, so I'm going to add the teaspoon of sugar and mix until it forms stiff peaks. The next thing you need to do is get a half cup of Nutella and then add the Nutella to the egg yolks. So I think that's just about good. That's good, right? Yeah, that looks like it's thoroughly mixed. So after you do that, you just add the egg whites. Now I've never learned like the egg whites, so this is the best I could really get it. I'm just gonna like, pour it in some. Okay. And mix. Add little bits at a time, and they said it'll be easier to mix in that way. Oh, and I forgot to say this earlier, but they wanted you to preheat the oven to 350 degrees. Okay, I think that's good. Okay, so they just said take an oven safe mug and fill it up, which it's already done, and then put it in the oven for 15 minutes on 350 degrees. Okay, hello people from the internet. I am sorry, I might have feelings. But we're gonna try the souffle. It looks like what a souffle would look like. I've never had souffle before, so I don't know exactly how it's supposed to look. It looks like what it would look like in a picture. It tastes good. It tastes actually really good. Yeah, it tastes really good. It t I can taste the Nutella. Mm -hmm. This is good. What you will need for this next treat is flour, sugar, milk, baking powder, cinnamon. I don't have cinnamon, I just have cinnamon sticks. So that. Salt, an egg, four to five apples, maple syrup, and oil. Okay, you wanna start off with your oil. Just heat two cups of that in a cast iron skillet. In a large bowl, mix together a cup and a half of flour. And then, I'm halving the recipe, so I'm putting a sixth of a cup. Okay, half of a third of a cup. Then I'm just adding one teaspoon of baking powder. Just the tiniest little pinch of salt and then I'm going to mix that 
cup all together in one other bowl they want me to mix a really really since I have it it's a really really small amount of milk uh, again a really really small amount of maple syrup now it's seven eighths I have it and it's seven eighths cup of milk which is really tiny so I just estimated and then it's one a cup of syrup maple syrup so again I'm just estimating because I don't really know exact measurement and then one egg and just a little bit of oil a half a tablespoon to be exact but I'm just gonna eye it that looks about right and then just mix that all together it smells really good oh my gosh next they just want me to pour the liquid mix into the batter mix and stir that until it becomes smooth so what you want to do next is just take the apple dip it in here and then fry it take it out dip it in some sugar and it's complete okay so i made all these apple fritters it was hard but now time to try one amazing so that was it for this video I hope you enjoyed watching me fail multiple times like I almost like caught my house on fire because of the frying oil okay don't be me and don't heat up your oil too soon it's not good so give this a thumbs up if you liked any of the treats or if you're going to try any of the treats I did today. Hit the big red subscribe button, I'll have it on the screen or if you're a mobile user down below there's a big red button, that's what you hit. Thanks for watching, bye!